Hello friends, welcome to Naresh IT. In this tutorial, I will explain how to read get parameters in a Node.js. Please open the IDE, which IDE, WebStorm IDE. Already in my laptop, WebStorm IDE installed. Let me create one directory. Right click, new directory. Read get parameters the directory name is the read get parameters inside the read get parameters let me create one of javascript file the javascript file is the server.js file let me create one of javascript file the javascript file is the server.js file inside the server.js file first of all import http module what is the HTTP module? Already you know in the previous tutorial already explained. What is the HTTP module? HTTP is the predefined module used to, to create the used to, to create the HTTP servers. How to import HTTP module? I want to import. How to import variable HTTP equal to require of variable HTTP equal to require of HTTP automatically HTTP module will be imported fine next one is the import URL module one more module import URL module how to import URL module fine why URL module URL module is the predefined module used to, to parse the urls used to, to parse the urls then only we are using the url module how to import url module variable url equal to variable url equal to require of we need to, to place the url automatically url module will be imported fine next one is the let me create the let me create the server let me create the which server HTTP server. How to create the HTTP server? Variable server equal to variable server equal to HTTP dot HTTP dot create server. Even of the function is there, the function is the create server. Variable server equal to HTTP dot create server of anonymous function we need to pass. For the anonymous function, we need to pass two parameters. What is first parameter, request parameter, what is second parameter, response parameter. Nearly two parameters we need to pass. First one is the request parameter, second one is the response parameter. Fine. We have the URL now, which URL, http colon slash slash localhost to colon 8080, username equal to Naresh and a password equal to Naresh. Some URLs are there now, that URLs will be stored into request object whatever the urls we have that urls will be stored into request object that url stored into request object how to parse it here we have the module which module url module url dot even of the function is there which function parse function url dot parse of we need to get the url or not how to get the url request dot url request.url whenever we call the request.url automatically we are getting the url that url i want to, to parse by using the parse function in url module to parse you need to give the permission how to give the permission true after parsing after parsing the url you need to query the url how to query the url with the help of dot query whenever we call the dot query automatically we can query the url fine Listen once again here very important. This topic is a very important. How to parse URL URL dot parse of URL. Where is the URL? URL there in the request object. So request dot request dot URL. To parse URL, we need to give the permission. How to give the permission? True. Fine. After parsing the URL you need to query how to query with the help of query that's it automatically we can query the url fine 
whenever we call the query it will return one object also which object variable opj variable opj equal to url dot parse of request dot url comma true dot query fine next one is the read the username i want to read the username variable username equal to variable username equal to obj dot obj dot uni automatically we can read the username fine please read the password also how to read the password variable upwd variable upwd equal to obj dot upwd automatically we can read the username and a password coming from the front end fine next one is the please compare it how to compare it if you name equal to equal to admin and upwd upwd equal to equal to admin or otherwise naresh and naresh you name equal to equal to you name equal to equal to naresh it and upwd equal to equal to naresh it if username equal to equal to naresh it and upwd equal to equal to naresh it here send the response which response response dot write off response dot write off h1 what we need to place we need to place the login success let me close the h1 else condition which else condition else response dot write off response dot write off response dot write off what we need to place we need to place the h1 login file let me place the login file can i close the h1 yes we need to close the h1 how to log the response object i want to, to bind the i want to bind the response object how to bind response dot end of response dot end automatically we can bind the response object how to set the mime type i want to, to set the mime type we forget to set the mime type let me set the mime type how to set the mime type response dot write head write head of status code status code is the 200 next one is the mime type which mime type the mime type is the content type content type colon text slash html automatically we can set the html as the mime type html as the mime type next one is the please assign the port number i want to assign the port number how to assign the port number server dot listen off port number is the 8080 next one is the console dot log off console dot log off here we need to place the some message server listening the server listening the port number which port number 8080 fine can i create the one html file let me create one html file here we need to create one html file let me create html file right click new html file which html file index.html file in index.html file please create the form i want you to create the form if it is angular you can create the angular application now in this tutorial i am explaining you how to interact with the html maybe in the future tutorials i will explain you how to interact with the angular fine observe this one here we need to take the form form action equal to form action equal to http colon slash slash localhost colon 8080 slash server address next one is the method which method get method this method is a get method so we need to place the get here take the username and the password how to take label username just to take the some spaces also some tab spaces we need to take take the input input type equal to text name equal to uname logical name equal to uname we need to place next one is the let me take the two lines break let me take the one more label label upwd let me take the so many tab spaces any number of tab spaces we need to place let me place the so many tab spaces yes next one is the input input type equal to password next one is the name equal to name equal to what we need to place upwd we need to place please take the one submit button i want to, to take the submit button please take the submit button input 
type equal to input to type equal to we need to, to place the submit button that's it first of all start the server we need to, to start the server node server we need to start cd space read get parameters how to start the server node server yes server listening the port number 8080 fine please launch this html fine please enter the username Username is the Naresh IT. Please enter the password. Password is the Naresh IT. Username is the Naresh IT. Password is the Naresh IT. Please click the submit button. Yes, login success. Just observe the URL also. If you observe the URL, localhost colon 8080 slash uname equal to Naresh IT and upwd equal to Naresh IT. So we are getting the message. The message is the login success. If you enter the wrong credentials, if you enter the wrong credentials, now we are getting the login file. That's it. This is the way to read the get parameters in Node.js. Reading the get parameters by using one module, the name of the module is the URL module. That's it. Thanks for watching this tutorial. In the next tutorial, I will explain how to read the post parameters. Thank you.